Hey guys, in this video, we will see how to install and set up Contact Form 7 in WordPress. For doing so, you will have to be logged in inside your WordPress dashboard. Then you will go to Plugins, click on Add New. Once you click on Add New, you will have to search for a plugin over here named Contact Form 7. As soon as you hit enter, the first one which comes over here, which is this one, having one plus, I mean one million plus active installs, you'll have to click on install now for this one. As soon as you click on install now, it will start installing. And once it has been installed, you'll have to click on activate plugin. Once you activate it, it would be over here. And in addition to that, you'll also have a contact um, settings or dashboard you can see over here in this left hand side panel so if you click on this contact then it will open up all your contact forms which you have created and by default you will have one contact form which you have all right so how to use this contact form one so let's just visit any of our pages so let's say i want to insert that contact form on my contact us page so what i'll do i will just edit this contact page and let's just open up this contact in a new tab so i'll open this contact tab inside a new window and then i'll just simply copy this short code and paste it over here and i say update for this page and just let's view this particular page of contact so there you go the contact form has been saved on our WordPress page. So this is how you install and set up your contact form 7 page. But now you might be wondering after having this form, this was an easy part, but how do you integrate your email within this? So you once again go to your contact form, you click on edit. Once you click on edit, you will have all these settings over here right this is a code where if you have coding knowledge you can just tweak it around or you go inside mail and you will say to mail all right you will have your email address over here then you will have a from email address over here all right and then you will have your subject additional headers if you want to change some message body over here you can change it over here so all this is by default all this is by default and if you go inside messages, then these are the by default messages which people would get. All right. And some additional settings. So now let's check for real. All right. Let's go inside this and enter some dummy text. So let's say name is, I type in my name and I will say my email address. So I'll type in one email address as well. And I'll say test subject and I'll say test message and let's hit send so this is the message which i get your message was sent successfully thanks so basically this is the sender's message which is given to each and everybody all right so let's suppose if i change anything over here and that message would be changed over here as well all right so then you have sender's message was failed to send so if somebody has uh, done something wrong and the message failed then he or she will get this kind of message so all this all this messages which are by default preloaded you can change all these settings over here and once you are done you can just click on save and that's it you are done all right so this is how you do this is how you do so now you will get this email inside your email address which is this one all right so let's just check this out if it is working or not so let's just visit gmail so let's see if i have got this email on my contact form page so it's loading and there it is so what i have done is this sender had an email address which was i me and you are awesome at gmail.com in addition to that i'm collecting all this visitors message to this email address so right now i have the sender and receiver email addresses same that's the reason why it's on the same panel 
let's suppose you have your professional ID over here, then you will be collecting all this kind of emails from your visitors to this particular address, which is in two. All right. So if you see, this is a test subject and it will be like from Pratik Singh, I'm me and you are awesome at gmail.com, subject as test subject, message body as test message. And this email was sent from so and so. So this is how you get your message from contact form seven. So I suppose that was very easy, as simple as bread and butter. All right. So if you like this video, give a thumbs up. And if you are liking this kind of videos, and if you want to follow, then you will get one video per day, at least one video per day. So just subscribe to my channel and enjoy the stuff. See you in the next one. Till then, take care. Bye-bye. Stay awesome.